It might be one of the most biggest art projects in Rochester Hills history. Dozens of people working together to create something the entire community can enjoy. This is definitely really something to see. Our Paula Tupman is live this afternoon to show us the huge mural. And this is kind of like a paint for number, but really for all ages, Paula. <laughs> you know, Karen, you're right. First of all, it is the most biggest. I think it really is. This is how it starts out. So it kind of starts out like this. So as a drawing, they kind of have a template. You see some of the numbers right there. They go to some of these panels over here and then take a look at this. So here is the mural, but this isn't all of it. This is only half of it. That just gives you a sense of how massive this project is. The Rochester Hills community mural is mammoth. 76 five by five foot squares to create a 1800 square foot mural. It's 90 feet long by 20 feet high. And everyone and anyone is invited to reserve a space to immortalize their brush strokes in art. We've had folks from as far away as Wixom and Novi come out. People tell friends and co-workers and, and then they tell um, families. We've had grandchildren drag their grandparents. The mural is sweeping, inclusive with families of all stripes, wildlife of all kinds, and the artists, everyday people with their own special stories to tell. Get your cheese melted, okay? We introduced you to Rising Star Academy when it first opened in Centerline. It's a culinary art school for special needs adults, and they're doing so much to expose their students to the things that enrich their lives. And so it was really great to see some of their young chefs in training put down their stirring spoons for a paintbrush. This is my way to show my artistic side. And so that way when I get out there in the real world, I can show what my talents are. Basically, that's what it's about. It, it expresses your 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 artistic like like to be creative and stuff our friends at rising star and our friends at woodside special needs sunday school adult class they are responsible for i want to say about 35 panels I've been lucky enough to paint a few panels yeah when the mural is done it will grace rochester college so it can be seen from the clinton river trail all 1800 square feet of community mural. Well, we have a very beautiful spot down on the back of our campus uh, that students have enjoyed for years since the college was founded in 59. And uh, it's been very isolated. We thought this mural would make a great uh, welcome mat uh, for the park for people to come in and enjoy it like we have for years. I don't know how that's possible. Okay, so take a look. So X marks the spot. This is what they've gotten done. This and this is what they still have to do. They think they've got about three more weeks of painting. They would love everyone to come out, but you just can't show up and paint. You've got to actually register. So if you contact or connect with Rochester College, they can show you how to register. Bring your kids, bring your grandparents, bring your neighbors. This is a community-wide project. They're going to get it up on that building. They're going to cover it with a very special material so it lasts forever for everyone to see, Karen. I really love the idea. Okay, you said all ages. I mean, can you really bring the little kids to help with these murals? Because what if they don't yes. stay in the lines? Is that oh okay? Oh my gosh. Absolutely. Just make sure you got something to clean them up because you know it is paint yes. and they are little kids. That's but they right. want all comers to come out and be part of this community and you don't have to be from this community. I they just like want it. you to come out. 